What's up, Pioneer fans? This is Get to Your Pioneers. I'm Max here, and today I'm joined by Joshua Sandoval, one of the catchers on the MNU baseball team. Thanks, thanks for coming out today. Thank you for the invite. Of course, Appreciate of course. Um, what's with the glasses? Can we talk about this real quick? I mean, it's just uh, my swag, man. You know, like I like to look good at the field. Uh, I try, you know, earn some respect by looking good. You know, if you look good, you play good. Even when you're just in the dugout for an interview? Yeah, just, just, just so we, yeah. <laughs> I can't argue. I can't argue with, with, with a fair answer because that's just, yeah. it just it just makes sense. Let's just say that. Now, you're from Puerto Rico originally. Yeah. You kind of came here after, you know, you, you went to a few schools before this. Yeah, I went to uh, Florida Southwestern and then I went to Western Oklahoma. Um, I didn't play. I got, I got hurt. Uh, my transfer uh, my transfer never got there, so it was just little hard to figure things out, so I went back home, stayed there for a while, and then I came here. Okay. And you went to a, a school called the Carlos Beltran Academy yeah. in Puerto Rico, which is uh, it's pretty famous in Puerto Rico for, you know, yeah, it's taking a, like players to the United States, right? Yeah, it's a high school. Like, they have uh, facilities to play baseball. Um, you go to school and play baseball at the same time. Okay. Um, they have college placement. They have good facilities. and good mentors out there and basically that's where I came from uh, I went uh, sophomore junior and senior year of high school there and after I, after that I ended up going to college found a good scholarship from there okay yeah so definitely helped you out uh, now they play baseball is the biggest sport in Puerto Rico yeah but there are definitely. a few other sports that are bigger so did you always play baseball or did you do um, I played baseball um, throughout my whole life I tried basketball once, and that didn't end up well. No, basketball isn't for you. Yeah, it's not for me. So you're one of two engaged players on your team, as I learned from you about uh, 90 seconds ago. Uh, you're currently engaged to Jennifer Roth here on the MNU volleyball team. So like, what's hit up to fans about love stories, basically what I'm saying? Well, um, basically I met her here at campus. Uh, I was at the library sitting one day, and I was like, oh, this girl looks really pretty. And then... Uh, so one of my friends over, uh, I like told her she was cute. Oh, there. You're one of them. Yeah. You can't go I, 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 I wasn't gonna go myself. Okay. Then I messaged her on Instagram. And then like, it was cool. Like we talked for a little bit and we started hanging out and just kind of engaged, I guess. That's that's <laughs> what I call me cute right there. <laughs> um, so you've been here for three years now. You're a junior. Um, and you've been known to crush the ball out there. Like you know, hit a hit a quite a few home runs. So, uh, have you always been a power hitter? Like, what's what's the deal here? So, um, growing up, I couldn't hit much. Oh, like when I was like twelve, uh, like I struck out a lot. It was frustrating. So I put a lot of time, a lot of time and effort to hitting. So I was okay at defense. So I was like, let's just work on hitting. Okay. Um, when I was like 13 years old, that's when everything started clicking for me and I started hitting balls harder, like balls started going farther and stuff. And it was kind of impressive like to see like when you put the work needed, uh, things change. And I put a lot of effort into hitting and it just uh, developed really well throughout high school. I was one of the best power hitters in my class in Puerto Rico. Oh. And I earned a lot of respect from that, I guess, you know. Absolutely. I've been told by some of your teammates, and you as well, that you're a big movie guy. Yes, sir. So what's your favorite movie? My favorite movie is Dark Knight. Dark Knight, one of the old Dark Knights. So. Yeah. What's your favorite genre of movie? I'll say action movies. Dark Knight mm -hmm. runs exactly well. Do you like the Rush Hour movies? Yes, sir. Oh, dude, they're, they're yeah. some of my favorites. Love those guys. Just, just some classic movies. What about uh, Bad Boys? Oh, that's my favorite, man. Oh, that's like my second now. favorite. Let's that's go. my second favorite, man. This is bonding right here. <laughs> that, that's what this is, if you're wondering. Yeah. <laughs> um, now, you're, you're one, you have one year left here. And so what are you trying to do afterwards? Well, I'm trying to go pro. Definitely, like, I'm trying to get drafted either this year or, last year, or next year. I want to finish my degree and start playing professional baseball. Um, you know, like, just try to do my best. Try to get to the big leagues. Try to get to the show. Yes, sir. Okay. Well, um, as of today, I'm trying to go pro too. So I need to learn how to hit better. Okay. So basically, what I'm saying is, can you teach me oh, how to hit course. better? Of course, I got you. All right, I let's do you. it. Let's, let's do, do it. it. All right. So 
I stopped playing baseball when I was uh, 10. Okay. So I don't know how to hit at all. So uh, what what tips do you have for me? Well, for like, what well, works for me is like I try to stay in balance with my legs. First, like, first thing I go to, play, I go to a pass try to get a good balance in my legs. Because I don't want to be out in front or I don't want to be leaning back as the pitch is coming. Yeah. So I try to get a good, good stance so I get comfortable. And I just try to relax my hands as much as possible. Because, like, relax means fast for me. And as, as long as I'm fast in the zone, I'm able to touch baseballs if I get it on the barrel. Okay. Right here. Right there. Uh, do you think I look like a baseball player? Uh, a little bit. There's some weight room kind of thing. But oh, you're saying I'm small. No, no, no. You're good. No, I'm so not small. <laughs> you're okay. I'm okay. I'm okay, guys. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Let's hit some balls. All right. Let's do it. All right, uh, I'll be doing some batting practice now. Um, you think I'm, I'm prepared? Looking good. Looking good? Looking soggy. Uh, that's exactly what I like to hear. Let's do this. All right. So uh, I just hit. How do I? How do I do? Look pretty good to me, man. Oh really? Yeah. Oh wow. Let a okay. let a hard ball hit to the middle, of the field. That's good. Yeah, I was known back in the day as the guy just right down the middle. Yeah. Occasionally, occasionally went opposite field, just cracks home runs. Home runs. Right, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I was killing the team all days, bro. Yeah, it, it, it definitely looked like home runs today. All days, yeah. man. Appreciate yeah. it. I try. I try. Anyway, this has been Get to Know Your Pioneers. I'm Max Hearing. This is Joshua and Sandoval. Go Nears. See you guys. What about uh, soccer? Never tried that before. Ever? Never. Wow. Interesting. That's not a big sport for a regular year. It isn't. You're right. That's my mistake. No, you're, you're good. good. That's a great movie right there. <laughs> um, now, uh, you're actually, you're the only engaged member of your baseball team, I believe. That's not true. That's not true. That's another great movie. <laughs> Now you're married to a. Uh, you're okay. engaged. <laughs> <laughs> another blooper. No, number, number three. There's, there's gonna be a lot of bloopers. <laughs> <next. laughs> okay. Uh, okay. A good one. You're gonna go blow yourself. Man. Wow. I, it's, 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 I lose it. Just... Absolutely. Uh, the question has to go on. What's your favorite like, genre of movie, though? The who? What? <laughs> <laughs> what? John Ruff, John Ruff, John Ruff. Oh, okay. All right. Um. <laughs> <laughs>